I feel it. I feel the mountain. Mm -hmm. I feel it the cloud. Mm. I feel it the wind. I feel it the cold weather. Huh, That's I try to talk about this tree. That's come up what the relationship the tree with me. This is Robert from Asia Pacific Gardening. One of a friend bring the tree to here to try to study. And this is a nice image tree you can see. And before I touch the tree, I would like to everybody on the screen look at the tree. What do you think? What you want to do? I know this will be coming up with hundreds of different ideas. But remember, when you have the container like this, most important you want to see the drum. So what I'm suggest, take it out from the container like this because the blocking the beauty of the tree, that is hard for you to study the tree. Customer find out this material from the local nursery is so you're lucky to get the nice tree like this. That's one when you're going to do the bonsai. This is one to suggest you study the tree. If the study have a lot of good structure, you will save a lot of time to get the beauty of the tree to show up to everybody. So I'm trying, this is a Lebanon uh, cedar. So we are in Seattle. So if we have a nice weather right here and this is the time we can study the tree, maybe we can repot it. But like I say, we need to take it up from here. Look at this, how much different. You see the trunk? You see the nice root system right here? See the, the body right here? The structure is give you a lot, a lot of option with a container like this. So we're gonna take this out and we study the tree. Like I say, when you study the tree, don't looking at the tree like this, you're not gonna see any good structure. So that's why the camera, Nolan, always put down the camera by the eye level you will see better please think about this tree how do you want to upgrade this tree if this is front of you the tree what you want to do you can see or oh, this is the front or this is the front or this is the front or this is the front not only that you can see we have the you can put some cushion on the bottom you can see here if this is the if you think this is the front you may take a look go like this that would be a nice cascade right this could be a nice cascade this is and you get the blue right here and this 11 on uh, cedar is really flexible you can see the angle let's take a look the other side if you think this is the front and put the angle like this what do you think so by looking at this right here is this like a clip on the mountain the tree grow the cascade right here there's nothing right there they're talking about the thousand feet down to the floor to the ground level that's what have a really good character let's take a look the other side like this how do you think I know you come out a different idea already. Some of you That's like cool. the other one, some of you like the other one. Uh, we're not gonna have the same image, but see what we can do. Even what we're going to do today, my idea is not the only one way to do it. It's not necessarily the one I do is the best, okay? So from, up, from the, the screen right here, I'm facing with a lot. I know you guys is the good artist and make a comment subscribe for this video and discuss on the on the group so let everybody study together and that's the why we make a video like this we want to study each other remember when you put the different angle we be looks different right look at this right here what you feel the tree that's like the other side but it's so flat at the top yep the flat on top but we done any size and we can do we done this one right and we done this one this one how about this one right here one thing I saw I really like the the bari right here this is a really nice value 
the tree right here see here is really really nice give you a lot of good character so by looking at the tree from the different angle when I saw the tree you same like I'm growing if I'm climbing to the mountain you know give me the climate feeling wind the cloud around here in the early morning okay and how high this elevation cold I'm feeling like one to make wear the jacket that the what I'm feeling that the plant talking to me this is not going to right on the ground and the sea elevation this is the tree we want to create in the top of the mountain with the wind with the cloud around it with the have a cold jacket you will stay right there looking at this that the one related with you okay so which way we want to do every angle is a different and I feeling this is too flat right here we maybe can bring this up we can maybe bring this up you can of course you need to wire this to get the new a pad then we have we can look at after we wiring this if we need it but right now the tree is so bushy so many branches not showing the good character at this moment for me so what we can do we're going to clip it up open up the tree see what we can what we can upgrade it there's some dead branches like this you just cut it off after we study from the different angle of the tree I tried to use this is the this is the front of the tree and we're going to wire firstly clean up a little bit and we're going to wire this and make the new a pack right here and this one bringing up but this one bringing up too so you can see between right here and this one have to because this one just cover up the main nice nice branches right there so if we can open up that would be showing really nice structure Okay. If you bring the camera right here, you can see here, this is too many branches right here. They're not showing the good structure. So we don't need to have that much uh, the, 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 the branches right here. And some of them like this one here, clean it up. Like here, we're just cleaning up, cleaning up cleaning up you can see right here it's cleaning up so we get the space in between this one here take it out now of course we need the wire a little bit but right here right here here do some clean up of course when we wiring the branches you know which one and a lot of time like this has come from the same point like this I keep the one outside the one inside right here take it out this one come from the same point open up and you can see here too many branches right here so we have one right here very nice one just open up this one clean up this one and again see here this is one two three four see one two three four we want to get the space in between and here again see one two three four that's too many and we have one right here of course to take the middle one out and take the middle one out 
and dig this one out. I think we open up a little bit better right here. already a big difference see open up so if you not open up this it's hard to wire because you have no space for the wire can training the tree you see here the beauty of the tree you can see from here some of the dead branches inside like this one This one here, this one here, that's why I like this scissors is long. You can some different power. You can use it. You can get a pair of these at pnetools.com slash bonsai. And if you use the promo code bonsai at checkout, it'll save you 10%. And thank you, PNE Tools and Barnell for sponsoring this video and to continuing to provide awesome tools with our promo code so I just cleaning up some extra branches right here so when you're pruning the tree look at this small tree right here look at the what the small tree right here I call tree this is like a small bonsai so we want the training this as a small bonsai and see what we can do same thing clean up Remember what they look like right now, okay? See here? This is too pushy. Up video. I got squat a lot. See, this is like a small, nice bonsai, right? That's what we're doing. See this two three which one you like I like this one I'm going to remove this one how do you like this small bonsai right here look at this this is like a cascade this branches here the style is almost same like the style right here looking at the big so without this See here, if we go like this, it's the same. See? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's the same like this one here. It's talking each other. And I believe this is still too pussy right here. So now I can say we need to clean up a little bit more. This is, this is probably the, the, the end of the cascade. We don't move that one yet. But this one, there you go. So when you're pruning the tree, you just section by section. Now we have a small tree right here. Look at this here, small tree. We should get the small white color paper. Okay, so there's the paper, we turn the tree around. Now you can see what Robert was talking about. So this is the detail. So see, imagine this, is, this was a tree, right? And you can see here, compared with this, this is still too busy. Plus special this side right here, you can see it. 
We're not done anything yet. See here, compare oh, yeah. this two. Now we need the working on this part right here. This take a time. That's why you pay the time, you pay your knowledge, you pay for your investment right here, make the tree looks better. See, compare this. Don't worry about the, the other part. Just finish this part. Section by section, you will see the better tree on the end of the finish. So I'm going to go to this one here pretty soon. Hopefully I can go like this. And we can see. You can see the one in the bottom I clean up. We don't need this. You can see how much the different open up. Right here, you can see this is so many branches. Sorry, I have to hold the paper on the bottom to try to show you. I can hold the papers, just don't cut my finger. You see the difference? See right here, there's too many right here. I always keep the space in between. So in case you need to wire the plant, then you have the space to put the wire on. And here you can see this is a still busy, bushy. So, see what we can do. I'm going to cut this top right here. Ghost. Hello, ghost. Okay, you can see the difference. Let me put this. Oh, yeah. See? And this part here down, and you can see this whole section right here is a really nice bonsai. Look at this. From here. Right? Compare with this. Look at this here. This is not done yet, but you can see a lot of branches we need to open up. We can we can do this one here, they can see how much a different, okay? Let's do this one again. See here. So Consider it a nice bonsai. Clip this one. This is the one branches connected to carrier right here. Open up. And I don't need this. I don't need this. Which one would you all cut? And see here the bottom. So I got the different angle right here, but I like this one here, but this one here, you can see it, sorry I moved around, this one too close to each other, you can see I'm going to clip this off, and I'm going to clip this off, now open up. See? And now, we're working on here. This is too close to the main trunk, so we don't need the depth close. And open up. See here, one, two, three, four, they all line up together. Open up one. See, I open up this. I don't need this. This one here, this is too close each other. This one too pushy right here, but I need to put my hand right here, okay? So stay with me. 
See, if you have the background green, it's really hard for you to look at. See here. And we don't need this much. How nice this bonsai right here. Look at this. Look at this. You can see this part is busy, right? Yeah, right over there. Right over here. I need to move my hand. See here? So many branches. One, two, three. Take the one in between. That one right. And I don't think this would be help because this is one two three and this is the go inside here you go oh good thing we have a sharp needle no scissors and this one too close to the main main branches right here open up look at, that. Look at this here climb that now okay take a look around the front so people always say how too difficult to bring the tree you just need to go the section by section see the detail that was one section of like Take a time. Take a time. This is why bonsai teaches you patience. Yes. And you immediately you can see this one here. You can see this one here is nice bonsai. Look at this here. Let me put my red see here. Oh. See this is right nice here. bonsai, right? Yeah. And we have one nice bonsai on this side here. Then this section here, I see from this one here, we maybe need to remove this one here. Right here. I'm sure this is the one Ooh. we want to remove. I didn't hesitate. I will wait until next week. So, I'm done with this part. I'm done with this part. I'm pretty close to done this part, but still has some detail need to open up. Open up. And you can see immediately right here, see she, this part here is so busy right here. You compare with the, what we open up right here. So, this one, Remember what they look like. Let me put the paper one down right here, okay? If I can prune like this, a little bit difficult for me, but I try my best, okay? I want to show you. You see the difference for this part? I open up. Like a small bonsai. And this section with this section, see here, already open up. Oh yeah. And this section already open up. And this section is big open up right here. This is nice cascade. And this section we done already, and we finished pretty much finished this section right here. You can see that's a detail. If you have any question, please you can put a comment and for discuss. Of course, I'm facing the tree is quite different than you guys looking from the screen because we looking at even I'm looking at here. If I move to the other side little bit distant will be looks different once in a while and it go like that now from this angle i looking at this branches here this is too many branches we don't need it we don't need this one here
Alright, and we'll use the same technique with the rest of the tree. Yes. So, if you're the beginner, to print the tree is always difficult and confuse you because you don't have a nice background like this right here. The earlier we use the white paper is give you some idea. You can use the towel, solid towel color, you know, not the green one because this is green. Get the light color, you can see the difference. See here, when you cover up, they're showing the detail. And remove it. No, and remove. when you remove it, there will be, look at it, boom, it's really difficult to looking at the background, it's not clear. Same thing, the one we did before, where's that? See how beautiful the tree right here? Then you can catch up, touch up a little bit. The old, you know, from here I see some extra branches I need to clean up. Yeah, a lot easier to see. It's easy. Don't work. confuse with the other one. Now, compare the apple to apple. This section we already pruned. You can see here. Look at this here. How busy is this one right here? So if you put this towel under here, Super bushy. Super bushy, then you know which one you want to clean it up. And as a beginner, it's a lot easier to digest what part to trim if you do one section at a time. Yeah. Otherwise, this is kind of too big section. So yeah. let me let me go to the front right here, so we can working on this one small bonsai right here. Okay. So, like example, I bring the paper right here. That's one bonsai. So this is one bonsai. If you have a couple. So let let working on this right here. Clean. Because we have a nice big trunk right here. We don't need this. Remember, I always take it's a nice big trunk right here. This is extra one. Well, just take it out. And this is close to the main main branches right there. Clean up. Clean up. Clean up. See here, this is many branches right here. And this has come from the same point. We want one, two, so we take this off. Oh, we got both of them? Yes. And this one, we don't need it. And this one, we're not sure yet. But this one, open up. This one, open up. And the end here is very careful. It's nice to have the paper background. You can see here, look at this. Clean. Clean. Now we can see this is an extra right here, clean up. The structure clean. So we need to clean up this part right here. See here, too tight. Sorry. If they're really too tight, you maybe can consider by hand to open up by hand like this. I don't need this one here. I don't need this one here. Look at this section. Right? Remember the before. Before what they look like. And now we open up this part right here. And 
and this is too long for me. Okay, you can compare now. Look at this, what we done. It's really nice cascade, right? Yeah, buddy. Or if you're looking at the tree like this, this is really nice bonsai tree. Nice. And now I can see it. Most of the time I don't like this two from the same point. Look at it, what the difference. One, one, go up like this. Does that make sense? Let us know what you think in the comments, if this is helping. Hopefully this can help you. And now we're working on this side right here. So we've done the rest, but we're not done with this side right here. Remember earlier we've been pruning the tree, open up the branches right here because we're planning maybe need the wiring. Uh, but you can compare it when we've done this, compare with this part here. You can see how messy is it here. It's not clean. And you can see so many branches. The one I suggest is open up in between. You, we don't look at this here. How many branches we've been cutting right here, right? and you can have a space so the light can go everywhere you can see the structure but right here just push it see here so which one would you cut so is well is this will be really confuse you so forgot this one here we're just working on this part right here first right here then this is from the back to the front. You can see one cut is already open up. Right? And this part open up. So this is what it looks like before. So let's see what it looks like once we cut it. So after we spend the time a little bit and we open up, you can see you remember what the before and we compare with the branches right here. This is similar the structure this is quite open and if you're looking at again you wonder you forgot what they look like look at this right here the what before we do it would be look like this see here how pussy is this yeah. that the one you want to open up okay so if you if you difficult to figure out how to do this remember this is one small bonsai right here but is is really hard it's nice to look in here but remember i tell this is one bonsai let the camera go the other side see like this this is one nice bonsai look at this that's what you want to print the only different way is you're looking at this side you see the structure can you see what was pruned So next part, I'm going to working on this part right here. So I already done a little bit pruning, but again, this is really bushy right here. So it's, it's not going to take much time because we already have the pattern. We want this cleaning up. Stay with us. Hopefully you enjoy this. Let's see what it'll look like.
Look at this. Nice bonsai. You can see here, if they stand up like this, nice bonsai. Now I find out this is need to go. This is kind of dupussy right here. Back a little bit, open up. Nice structure, right? Yeah. And then we're working on this part right here. See here are too many branches right here. The caterpillar. Here you go. Turn it into a butterfly now. I think it'd be like 2028 circa. See this is keep touching the here. It's kind of too long. So I probably try to eliminate this one here. See? And this one kind of too long too. Let's go inside, that's why it's so bushy. Oh wow, look at that. It's so clean. Now you can see this one here. It's a large part. What does it look like now? Let's put the paper behind. Oh, look at those trees. All right, let's trim those. Now we pretty much is finishing the detailed pruning, but still after we pot it. We still need to make adjustment a little bit and you can see which branches we still need missing because we basically do the main branches of pruning. If you see something, you probably see from your camera, oh, Robert missing something. Don't be surprised. Yes, this would be, this is not finished. You can take a look at this side right here. But I love this side here. This is really good one. This, this part here is really, really nice. Look, look at this that. here. This is really good detail. Yeah. Look up here. And looking up right here, let's see. See how much we do? We open up. So if you want to put the wire on, it's easy. You have the space. Then you can like the long one like this. See here. It's really flexible. Yeah. And this is a really nice tree. This one here, I said, is too, too much, too much right here. Now open up. There you go. Let's take a look this side right here. See, this is like a nice cascade, right? Oh. See here, like a nice cascade. The, like a waterfall flu. This one also nice cascade too. Nice. And some of them a little bit busy right here, but we need we probably need to wire this up. We're not sure yet. And this part right here. I don't know this part right here. We maybe need to bring down this. This is still too busy right here from my side right here. I know we're going to 
open up this one here. You can see the difference. Here you go. So, at this moment, my idea, my idea, now this is flat. So I'm going to use the wire to finish this, you know, get the, get the flu from the other side like this. And this one bringing up a little bit, this one bringing in, because this one turret to you. I don't like the branches turret to you. I'm going to make it branches like this. But I need the space in between, so I need to bring this up a little bit. Maybe bring this back a little bit, get the layer. But this one will be on the back. So we're going to have the next video to do the next uh, section. But thank you for watching this video. We've been pruning the tree a lot. And one pair of scissors right here. Look so you this. can get that from pnetools.com slash bonsai. You get 10% off if you use promo code bonsai. The good thing this scissors you can go from the small brand, small branches like, like this one here to the big one here. Then you have to use the end of the scissors right here to give you some power. And I like the spring right here. That's why it, we do the commercial bonsai right here. Yeah, remember. This is our company, Asia Pacific Gardening. We're located in Ken, Washington. We're just 15 minutes away from SeaTac Airport. We're like a 15 miles south from the Seattle. If you're in Seattle area, you're welcome to come visit my place. We have a plenty of bonsai supply and we're going to give you a tour to study each other. And this is what for today. And thank you again for watching this video. See you the next section for how to plant this plant in the container and do a little bit wire, see what the finish. Please hit like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications. Look at this tree. We'll see you next week for the follow-up with the wiring and the potting.